guys, look who I'm with. So, what just happened? I had an interview. So Jesse just had an interview and it went really well, right? It did. At the dentist office. So yeah. we're in a super big hurry. So we have about 45 minutes <laughs> to work out because she has a hair appointment. Because so I did a video for a friend who has a salon and they said, we would do your, we'll do your hair for you. And I was like, I don't need you to do my hair. I go to a barber shop. Um, so I said, will you do her hair? And they said, yes, we will. So she has an appointment at one o'clock. It is now 12 o'clock. So we have about 45 minutes. And I think for the next 45 minutes, I'm gonna commandeer this bench right here. I'm gonna do chest and shoulders as much as I can on this bench. No one can have it in the whole gym. It's my bench for 45 minutes and her bench too. And we're gonna get this workout and then she's getting her hair done. I, I think when you get your hair done, I'm probably gonna drive home and take a shower. Okay, bye. Okay, let me interrupt this workout footage. I just wanna say how great of a workout I had in 45 minutes with just one bench. It was, I, I wasn't expecting it to go so well, but it went really, really well. It was really fun challenging myself to try and do as much chest and shoulder workouts as I could with one bench in 45 minutes. So what I decided to end up doing was four supersets, right? So I started off, the first superset I did was uh, just dumbbell bench press, flat dumbbell bench press. And then I, after that I did uh, seated shoulder press. The second superset that I ended up doing was incline dumbbell bench press with lateral raises with dumbbells. The third superset that I did was just incline push-ups or just push-ups with the bench, you know, using the bench and keeping my feet on the floor. So a little bit easier than regular push-ups. And then after that, I, I mixed that in with, I believe it was front raises on those. And my shoulders were absolutely on fire when I was doing those. I was just like, oh my gosh, this hurts so bad. And last but not least, I did uh, chest flies, which I haven't done in a long time. So I did just dumbbell chest flies with the incline a little bit on the bench press. And then I mixed that in with some traps. So I just did some, I don't even know what you would call them, dumbbell trap raises, tra just raises with my traps. I'm sure there's a trap, I don't even know. Right now, my brain is going crazy. I'm like super itchy because the uh, the beta alanine, I, I forgot my the G Fuel, and G Fuel, as you guys know, does not have any like stimulants, like, well, it has stimulants, sorry. It doesn't have any beta alanine in it, which, and beta alanine is the stuff that makes you itchy when you use it, but today, I so I forgot that, so I took some C4 that they have at the gym, and I was just like itching during the workout, and I'm still kinda itchy right now. Uh, but yeah, so that was the workout. It was really, really solid. And then now I'm about to take Jessie in and she's gonna get a haircut. Now we are here in the salon right there. And then that's our friend's salon right there. So this is the before. So I just got home now and it is time for me to take a shower to get out of all this sweatiness. So now I look like this and after. All right, we're all cleaned up in my regular clothes. I've really been enjoying actually trying to put on outfits and, and wearing outfits, even when like I'm not planning on doing anything really crazy. I think it makes me, especially with my job, you know, it's a lot of just computer work, editing, replying to emails. A lot of stuff is done just at home and I'll sit at home and I don't necessarily have to dress up or even dress nice. Like I wouldn't say I'm dressed up right now, but just wear regular clothes. But personally for me, it just makes me feel a little bit better. It makes me feel more put together. And I, I really believe that if you feel like you look nice, you will perform better in just any aspect in life. So I'm really happy with this outfit. It's very simple, just a denim jacket, white t-shirt, black pants, and then some like boot chuckas. I think these are like chuckas. But yeah, just a very simple outfit. I'm, I'll stop talking about my clothes. Bouncy, 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 Go down! All right, and there we go, all finished up. What do you think? I like it a lot. Yeah? A I lot. like the little braid. Well, it's actually a big, very, very large braid. Yeah.
It's good. It's very good. I'll I'll still be your boyfriend. I was thinking if it was gonna be bad, I was gonna absolutely break up with you. No, but, but it looks great. Yeah, it looks great. So we still have a week. <laughs> we have a week at least now. <laughs> So whose idea was this? <laughs> to come here? Was it yours? Nice. Wow, great idea. So what'd you get? Tell me. I got just cinnamon roll. Like, cinnamon roll. Yeah, cinnamon roll. And then, of course, a glaze. I kept a little bit more classy. A little bit more classy. Just got an original. And then a chocolate sprinkle because doesn't that just look like a donut should look, you know? <laughs> that just looks like Homer Simpson wants to eat that. That's that <laughs> and then I got a coffee on the side. This wall, there's a reason why I decided to let myself have stuff like this. I'll talk about it in a little bit when I get home. I know at Christmas Kareem I kind of alluded to something saying, you know, this will be the last time I eat this. You guys will understand why. Um, or the last time in a, in a while. Uh, so, I wanted to let you guys know something that's going to be going on. So, I know a lot of you guys aren't Christian and stuff, but... This is just what I'm doing and why I'm doing what I'm doing. So I understand if you're not a believer, that's fine. Like, I'm not trying to convert you at all. I'm just telling you what's going on because the videos are going to be a little bit different coming up because there's some, there's a change that's going to be made. So for the next 21 days, starting tomorrow uh, or today when the video comes up, but I'm going to be doing a 21 day fast, um, not all food. So what I'm going to be fasting, basically at my shirts, they said you can kind of choose whatever you want. If you want to participate, it's up to you and then, you know, choose what you want to fast. And um, for some reason, it's really been on my heart that I've really been wanting to, I want to fast, so I want to fast meat. So I basically, I want to just try to be a vegetarian for 21 days, just to see, to see what it's like, because it's been something that's been on my heart and I feel like just something that I really do want to try and, and really try and like really do it for 21 days and commit to it and just, just see, I don't know why, but for some reason when they brought up the fast, that's the first thing that popped into my head was I should give up meat. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do. So that's going to be starting tomorrow. Uh, and in turn also, um, because I'm giving up meat, I just kind of felt like I wanted to change something else as well. So I'm also going to try and give up eating out as much. Um, so obviously Krispy Kreme won't be happening. I'm going to try and like, cut out like really, really terrible stuff that I, I don't eat Krispy Kreme that much, but it's something that, you know, I, I mean, I haven't had Krispy Kreme, but things similar to that, you know, that kind of food, just like pointless food that you shouldn't be eating or I, at least I don't like eating. Okay. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be, it's going to be a big change, but it's, I'm, I'm honestly really excited about it because I've never tried that. I've never tried to go meatless for any amount of time. You know, there might be days where I did like on accident, um, but I've never tried to do it just like a hundred percent. So I'm really excited. And this is something that I'm, I'm, I really am excited about. This, this is going to be different. Um, but I just wanted to bring this up because it's, you know, if I do, you know, a full day of eating, people are going to be asking. Why aren't you eating meat? That's why. So yeah, that's what's gonna be going on. That's gonna end today's video as well. Just wanna say thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. If you have any tips on you know me going meatless for this next few few weeks, please leave them down in the comment section down below. I know I, know I have a ton of people that um, are in that lifestyle and have been in it for a very long time, so I really appreciate that. But yeah, that's the video. Again, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate every single one of you guys. Um, I've been really enjoying making videos recently. I've always, I always enjoy making videos, but I've really been enjoying uh, just the style of videos that I've been making, more informational videos. I, I love making them because I love helping people as much as I possibly can, but I'll never stop making vlogs because I enjoy making them and enjoy editing them and stuff like that. I'm gonna stop rambling on, but yeah, that's the end of the video, I promise. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. There was one other thing that I wanted to say. Oh yeah, look how buff I am.